Hello, 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 everything Pisces. Welcome, 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 babies. If you're new here, welcome back. If you are returning, come on in, like, subscribe, comment, and share. Thank you guys in advance. You already know what it is, my loves. Kick your feet up. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit, and get comfortable, because we about to make it do what it do loves. This is Pisces, all placements, cross watchers, non-Pisces, you're more than welcome. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Okay, baby, so we're going to jump into this read, see what message spirit has for you guys today, what do you need to know for your greatest and highest good at this time. Um... We are using the Hoodoo Tarot deck, so sometimes I have to look to see what the cards mean, guys, because I don't use it often enough. But if I do, just bear with me. So we got John Horse here. Uh, what's that? Already, y'all. Uh, the Emperor. That's what I thought it was. So we got the Emperor here, babies. The Emperor jumped out. There's a lot of shit on this card. I feel like the Emperor needs some help. He got his hands raised. He in some type of trouble or something. The emperor could be surrounded by some type of spirits and could have some type of spirits attached to them. What's going on with this emperor for Pisces? What does we need to know about the emperor? So we have a queen of pentacles in reverse. There's someone angry, upset, bitter, broke. And the mother and the queen of wands, I mean the queen of swords at the bottom of the deck. So there's an ex. This emperor's dealing with an ex who's broke. Tell me more. What's going on here, Holy Spirit? Oh, that's a lot. Y'all would do that to me. So the eight of baskets, the eight of cups. They're walking away from somebody who's broke. Nine of coins and becoming single and stable. So there's an emperor who's walking away from somebody broke. A feminine energy that's broke. And they're becoming single. Page of pentacles. I mean, excuse me, page of cups. This person, this emperor wants to come in and apologize. Four coins. This, this feminine energy is trying to hold on to them. I got a lot going on here, y'all. Father of baskets. So the um King of Cups. So there's the King of Cups that's walking away. This masculine energy here. They they want to apologize for holding back. They held back because they were dealing with this uh, this mother, this angry, distorted mother, or this angry, distorted feminine energy. It could be a baby's mother. Yeah, this person's heartbroken, though. Three of knives, three of swords here. Somebody could have done something at the graveyard. This dog is pissing on the grave. But they're heartbroken. The third party is heartbroken because this person's walking away to become single. Ten of swords. There was a betrayal. Six of swords. They're leaving, um, headed towards emotional peace. Nine of cups. Wish fulfillment. After some type of five of knives, five of swords, they can be angry, upset that this person's leaving. Yeah, after some type of ending the death. There's a transformation here. So there's an emperor here who wants to apologize to you for holding back because they were dealing with a distorted um, baby's mother, a distorted baby's father, um, a distorted feminine energy, man or woman, just in this distorted energy here. And they were at a lack. They were holding to this person because of money. 
but they're finally walking away getting single. This person's in their feelings and emotions here because they got heartbroken. And this has come to an end. What's Dr. Buzzard? Hold on, y'all. Let me see what Dr. Buzzard is. Justice. Oh, okay. So, yeah, justice is being served. So the scales are being balanced when it comes to this connection here. A the sticks here. There's forward movement. Some type of quick communication coming in here. Four sticks. Yeah, about some type of union or celebration. So this person's gonna come towards you with some type of communication for union, celebrating. After walking away from a Queen of Pentacles in reverse that was trying to hold on to them. This has come to an ending. There was some type of death here, ending here. A transformation. Clarify the John Horse. So luck is in this person's favor. They could be closing out a karmic cycle. And they're praying that luck is in their favor. With this will of fortune. So this emperor is closing out some type of karmic cycle here. Verify the queen of coins in reverse. Queen of pentacles in reverse. So they could have been married to this person. Or they were in a long term committed relationship with this person. Verify the eight of baskets. Eight of Cups. Yeah, for the Ten of Cups. So this person thought they were going to have emotional fulfillment with this Queen of Pentacles. They could have married this Queen of Pentacles. They thought luck was on their side. They thought they were coming up. They thought they hit this Wheel of Fortune here. They're fighting Nine of Coins. And now they're going to be single. Yep, with the Queen of Coins. So this person thought, they thought that they were coming up with this, this Queen of Pentacles here. They thought they had emotional fulfillment. They thought they had a family. They had marriage here. They thought luck was in their favor. And now they have to walk away from this. They're fighting Son of Baskets, Seven of Cups. Yeah, this person had a lot of um, choices or options here. They found out that they were a choice or option. Now they want to come apologize for making you be a choice or an option. Six of Wands, they're hoping for victory and success here. Can I find the four coins here? Pisces energy. Yeah, so it was taking this person a while to come towards you because this Queen of Pentacles was holding on to them, wasn't trying to let them go. Had them stuck in this marriage or in this commitment. Had them thinking that they were going to get emotional fulfillment here. Told you. Now they want to apologize. Page of Cups again. Now they want to apologize because it did not work out like that. They're walking away single. Heartbroken. This Queen of Pentacles put them in some type of third party situation. Clarify the Father of Baskets. The Emperor in Reverse. Now clarifying is the Emperor in Reverse. The Emperor was up right there. And the Queen of Pentacles was in reverse. Now the Queen of Pentacles is upright and the Emperor's in reverse. They're leaving this connection because they didn't have emotional fulfillment. I told you six of coins. They 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 going towards their emotional fulfillment. And it wasn't with this Queen of Coins. They got heartbroken here. Clarify the three of knives. Yeah, five of swords. Somebody's angry. This third party is angry. They didn't get the news they thought they were going to get. Yeah, this person is moving on to a brand new beginning. So there's an emperor here who is shutting off their feelings, their emotions. They're walking away from a third party, a queen of pentacles, someone they were married to or in a commitment with, someone they can have a child with. Um... 
because of some type of third party situation. Seven of Swords, they were being lying, sneaky, and deceptive. So this person got caught in their lies. They were lying, sneaky, deceptive. There could have been a third party for some of them. Everybody didn't have a third party. But they were not honest with your person. Yeah. Ace of Wands about having a passionate new beginning. They were not honest. Now this person is their ex, Queen of Swords. Yeah, and this person is walking away, taking a leap of faith. The fool. They feel foolish. They feel foolish. Uh, this Queen of uh, Pentacles is a psycho. They're a whole clown out here in the streets, and they watching. Stalking. They're angry. Five of Swords. What's going on here, Holy Spirit? Can I find a Wheel of Fortune? Pisces energy. Yeah, so <laughs> this person thought they were getting luck in their favor, and what they got was dysfunction. A fucking dysfunctional family. All they do is argue and fight. They're arguing and fighting in front of the kids. It's always a problem, always an issue. Clarify the Four of Wands. Yeah. This person, this. Queen of Coins in reverse is a whole spiritual hater out here. They hate on your spirituality, your light, your magic, your power. Clarify the Ten of Cups. Mm. And this is why this person is walking away because they found out you got to pay before you lay. So this Queen of Coins who was broke um, is out here having sex for money. And this is why this emperor is walking away. Clarify the queen of coins. Yep. They out here playing with fire. They possibly fucked around and got burned. They could have an STD. They could also have uh, some type of spiritual entities attached to them, which is now attached to this emperor. Because I said it seemed like this emperor had some type of um, ghost or something attached to his ass. STD energy here. Spiritual demonic entities attached to his ass. Clarify this seven of cups. Yeah, see, this person was a whole energy vampire out here. They just wanted your person for what they could get. And they left your person drained. Clarify this knight of coins. Yep, and it's not only them that was trying to cause these delays or keep your person stuck. They had a little group of minions too. Friends assisting with hate. Taking turns on social media. So their little group of minions is also in on this bullshit. They friends are just as dysfunctional. The emperor in reverse. The emperor in reverse. If your emperor drinks, they may be over here abusing alcohol. But for most of you guys, I feel like this person is walking away because they found out they were dealing with an alcoholic. An alcoholic that's out here having sex for money. And also, maybe bisexual or gay for pay. So they having sex with anybody. They get drunk and they have sex with anybody if you got the right amount of money. Clarify the five of swords, pays and wands. Yeah, they, this third party was a whole narcissist out here wearing a mask. And they were just there for the money, a money grabber. This is why this person's walking away. I can't make it up. Pay if you want to play. This third party then got caught up out here having sex for money. Now your person's sitting around crying for help. Because they didn't fucked around and found out. Yeah, this third party also was doing some type of mind-altering spells. Like I said, I felt like they were playing with magic. That's why they, this emperor got these demons and shit flying around his ass. Yet this third party was very materialistic. It was all about the money. They were a narcissist, money grabber, and materialistic here. It's all about the money. They may also have some type of gambling addiction. But they were a whole backstabber. They stabbed your person in the back. 
and now they're angry. I said because they're angry because this person is walking away to become single, leaving their asses. This person grew up in an abusive childhood, so all they know is abuse and toxicity. Yeah, now she's losing her mind, or he losing his mind. It says she devil can't see clearly. They going crazy over here. Yeah, so there's a feminine energy that's a gambler. With his divine partner. It could be somebody they have children with. Well, that's usually a life partner. This could be your divine partner. Let's see what's going on. Pisces. Mm. This connection has come to an end. The relationship is over. End these closures. No second chances. Letting go. Watch my exit. So yeah, this emperor is done. They're walking away. Um, they took a gamble with the wrong person. The risk taker. The chances. Options. Hidden motives. Nobody's safe. This person, like I said, had other options. Put them in third party situations. Drained their energy. Was only dealing with them for their money. And this emperor now has found out the truth. It was never love here. It was all about what they could get. Yeah, this could be a karmic twin they were dealing with. They felt like this. Because they thought this was going to be their end-all, be-all relationship. They thought this was their soulmate. They thought this person had their soul to infinity and beyond. It, they felt like they had this insane chemistry with this person. But it was based on lust and the spell work. Yeah. Passion came out in reverse. It was all about sex. It was sex and money. This feminine energy in um, man or woman had this other person ready to explode. Had them feel like that they were all they wanted. Like, you know, it, they had this undeniable urge from this person. They couldn't stay away. And now that shit has come to an end. All this for real? Yeah, now this third party is sitting back watching. My family and friends are my spies. I know what you're doing. Fake accounts. I told you they had their friends assisting with the hate. There go that STD I was talking about. I can't make that shit up. It's a STD here. Um, sexually transmitted disease. But I believe for sure it is a spiritually transmitted demon. With all those ghosts and shit around this emperor. That's why this shit is coming to an end. This person is under attack from all the goddamn spiritual work that this third party was doing. Yeah, and it was all based on sex. It was sex magic. Sacral chakra. They did sex magic on this person. Yep, and now your person realized they were backstabbed. Whole smile on your face the whole time they wanted to take your place. Your person is now seeing the truth that you are their true soulmate. You are, yep, your divine partner. That you are the true divine partner, their true twin, their true high level soulmate, and not this third party. Look, you are the divine soulmate. They are now knowing that you are the truth. We come together for a purpose. You recognize me. They realize they were lied to. Yeah. They had an activation. It says alien species DNA activation. It says Anunnaki, reptilians, graves, mantis, palladians, and the giants. Yeah, they found out the truth about this third party keeping shit on the low. Low-key secrets, hidden information, hush. Not showing you, won't tell you, um, you won't tell, I won't tell it from energy here. For some of you guys, this could be a twin ray for you. Yeah, but they love you and they want to come tell you that they love you. I fell for you, unconditional love, strong attraction, and affections, please love me back. Now they want to beg for you to love you, love them back. Because they realize with you it's a whole vibe. Energy doesn't lie. Vibe check. Chemistry is electrifying. They realize this was just based on sex and money. It wasn't real. It wasn't real. Except for the situations. Yeah, I told you. This person was pretending they were fake. Living beyond their means. Now they're angry. Ready to explode. Because the truth has come out. They're under the pressure now. Of the truth. Yeah, this person has unconditional love for you here, Pisces. Genuine, certain love.
Anything else Pisces needs to know for this connection? Huh, this is the thank you card. It's a title card. So this person, this emperor may want to come back and say thank you, Pisces. Thank you for your support. Okay, do those come or not? Yeah, okay. So this person is coming towards you in the next days, weeks, or months. In the near future here with some type of offer on the table, a proposal, commitment. They, they want to come have something long term here with you now. Yeah, because the third party was um faking, pretending, living beyond their means. Yep. This person is now going silent, non-action towards this third party because they have realized the truth. Finding out, coming to light. So now they have put they have put distance between them. That's why the third party got their friends watching and stalking. So this person is no longer with this third party. If this is your story, you was worried about if they were still dealing with a third party. No, the third party is watching and stalking from the background. This emperor still has these demonic uh, energies attached to them, though. So I do feel like they're in the process of healing right now, releasing man or woman. Yeah. Um, your person is reaching out to you with telepathic messages. They can be visiting you through your dreams or sending messages through the songs. Yep. They want you to know they're done. They learned a lesson. Completion when it comes to this third party. It's over. Yeah, they want to come back and have reconciliation with you. They say you have a spiritual union. You're the one they have a soul contract with. And they want to come together. And they went quiet on the karmic. Third party relationship. They learned a lesson. And they're done dealing with this karmic. It's crickets. It's over. So if you've been waiting on your person to leave a third party situation. For a third party situation to come to an end. Your person has finally got the proof. That this third party is no good. That they've been sleeping around. They've been lying, sneaky, deceptive. It's different for everybody what the third party has done. But the truth is out. They have seen the truth. They got receipts. And now they just want to be happy. And they're leaving this connection. Holding us overjoyed and smiling. Yeah, now this person is going to want to reach out to you. So expect some communication, talk, conversation. They want to get on the same page with you. They want to come make it right. If they live with this, this third party. Or they're moving. Change your physical location. They sell in the house, selling the car, whatever. If they got businesses together, they, they are breaking this shit down. They're done. They're done. Yep. They are running from this quickly, racing, avoiding this third party. Yep. And it was drastic. It was an extreme harsh cutoff. Okay. This shit was hard. This shit was drastic. They found out this person had a third party situation, a love affair, dirty little secret. Download the shit they was doing on the download. Having sex for money. So now they want to come towards you and have something that's long term. A long term relationship, a commitment, something real. Yep. And they said this third party tried to entrap them with pregnancy, with money, playing with their heartstrings, and the truth is out. Yep, that they was dealing with a whole fucking drama queen out here. Thirsty causing chaos. Oh, thirsty bitch. Yep, and you are the divine fin. They now see the truth. Between the thirsty bitch and the divine fin. Man or woman. They said pull another deck. What deck, Holy Spirit? This deck. Okay. I'm going to pull this final deck, then I'll pull... Final messages for Pisces. This is I'm starting to realize the depth of our connection. So they're starting to see that you guys are the ones that have a true soul connection here. For real, Holy Spirit. It says, I am mindful of what I have done in the past. So your person is now realizing and ready to take accountability of their past actions here. And they, they trust you unconditionally, and they're hoping that they can build this trust back with you. It says, I wish for a different result. They wish things had been different. It says, we were too young to be together before, but I feel like this person was too immature. They weren't ready. They weren't ready. 
And whatever they said or did, they wish they could take it back. Going towards this third party. They wish they could take it back. And they said they're sorry for not being truthful with you. Anything else here, Holy Spirit, this week? Yeah, see, they're afraid that you may not be in the mood anymore, though. That you're over it. They have healed themselves, or that when they come back, they will be healed. Okay? And they're hoping that you, you're not in this, I'm not in the mood energy. They are afraid to contact you. Oh, it's, I'm afraid to be in contact with you. Because they were distracted in the past, or they don't want to be a distraction now. Oh. So they're trying to distract themselves. They're trying to distract themselves. It says, I don't show any emotions when people talk about you. So there's people around them talking about you. They're trying to distract themselves. People could be telling them, you feel stupid now because you went towards this person, didn't go towards this person. They want to reach out, but they're afraid you're going to you're gonna not be in the mood. Yeah. I hope that someday you will forgive me. So they're afraid that you may not accept them back here. But you are the most precious person in my life. Okay, babies? Although we are apart, I can still feel you. The truth was a bitter pill to swallow. See? For them to find out the truth about this third party, because they thought they had hit the jackpot, that shit was hard for them to swallow. They thought they had won, babies. They thought they came up. They thought they was the, what did it say, um, luck with Will of Fortune? They thought they had hit the Will of Fortune. They thought luck was in their favor. They thought this person with the nice body, the car, the, the money, whatever it was, was the shit. And it was nothing but a lie. They got played. Oh, come on. Like, where did it go? Where did it go? And the same way this card disappeared is the same way your person is disappearing on whoever this third party is. We got a Leo, Aquarius. A Sagittarius Fire Leo Aries Sagittarius Scorpio Air Aquarius Libra Gemini Libra and okay we have Virgo Pisces Confirmation Pisces or Cross Walkers so Pisces. We have Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So we're just missing water. Oh, and there go water at the bottom of the deck. So it's everybody. It's everybody. The actual zodiac signs we have out here though are Pisces, Virgo, Sagittarius, Libra, Aquarius, Leo, and Scorpio. But all the zodiac signs are here. So if it resonates for you guys, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye, my fishy babies.